Good morning, chicks and chickens. Welcome back to Old Man Farm. My name is Sid, as always. I need to change the UI. So, I'm gonna do that real quick, and then let's get into it. All right, so we have a lot on the docket today, and uh, I'm probably not gonna get to all of it because it's me, and uh, there's absolutely no way I can remember to do the things I need to do all in one day. So, those things are, uh, well, it's Lance's birthday, and I wouldn't mind saying hi to that hunk because uh, I hear he's got some good storylines, if you know what I mean. And um, we also need to go to Robin's to uh, get our big chest. No, I don't have any jokes about that. Uh, we also... What was the other thing? Oh, if it's raining, I need to go to Ridgeside, but it's not. What is this? Thanks for the help with the bug steaks. I couldn't have done it myself, of course. I just didn't have the time. Anyway, I only have money to give you right now, but I owe you one, and I won't forget that. So thanks. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome, Maddie. Oh, we have more! Uh, I ordered too much fertilizer for the garden. I bet you can put it to some good use. Take care. Thank you, Jody. Ah, uh, yes, the other thing I am being reminded in chat is uh, we do have a thing we can do with Mary Lewis's lucky purple jerk-off shorts, uh, which is a sentence that I loathe that I have to say, but uh, here we are. So we can take the, quote, lucky purple shorts, a gold bar, and zip zam boom uh, <laughs> we can wear them. So, on the docket for today also includes go and harass Marnie and Mayor Lewis with uh, our crusty shorts. So, uh, <laughs> let's do this, right? But, before we get into anything, we may as well do the things around the farm, or at least the ones that uh, can't. Can't wait. So, that's what? This? And, um... Well, really, that's about it. And I guess that could have waited, but if I do it tomorrow, uh, we will have missed out on a small amount of row, and we don't want to do that. Um, okay. Do the basics, and then we're probably going to go... Come on now. Come on now. There we go. We're probably going to go to Robin's first, I think. Uh, and then scoot our way down into town so we can strut our sweet new fashion. Uh, which is wearing someone else's shame, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but hey, that's fashion, baby. Uh, what was the other thing? Right, big chests. Okay, this is gonna be- this is gonna be a day of me getting my life back in order. I haven't recorded a day in quite a while. Um, also, I was told this. We can use our scythe to gather moss, which is nice, because uh, a lot of times I forget and don't have my axe on me. Of course we do today, so really not a problem, but hey, it's still there. I'm still into it. Now, I believe Robin's shop opens around 9. Let's check. And if so, yes, 9. We're going to take our happy little shorts, <laughs> which is what we're going to call those now, and we're going to do a little fishing for about 20 minutes. I was like, why are we throwing a cat head? All right. Because we're horrible, horrible people. Bam. And eh, we got time for one more. Oh, you know what? While we're up here, I need to check. Uh, I don't know what day uh, um, Lance is in town. Need to check on that, actually. Oh, uh, it was also told to me, and I, I do this, you know, at least once a season, where I go into Grandpa's shed, and I'm like, oh, man, I need to make more sheds so that I can have more casks. And again, that's not, that's not the way it works. So, uh, what is this? I'd like to add a few shortcuts. Oh, we could actually do that. Hmm. Perhaps. Okay, big chest recipe. There we go. Is there anything else we want? Wood chipper? Nah. Telefono? Nah. Well, that's a whole lot of nada. And I'm okay with that. Okay. So, thing one achieved. Now, I think that said, uh... Oh, I guess they do look different. Okay. 120 wood and two copper bars. So they are... over twice as much as a chest. Uh, for not quite twice as much space, uh, but the footprint is the same, so I, I guess that technically makes it efficient? Hmm, I'm not a big fan of that, but that's okay. I am a big fan of Dusty, 
So of course we must give him the many pets. Uh, and I'm even a bigger fan of harassing Lewis. Let's see what he has to say. Sir? 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 Sir, please. I know you're ignoring your shame, but you can't hide from your shorts forever. They haunt your basement. Hello. Okay, Lewis uh, is giving us the cold shoulder. Let's go find Marnie. <laughs> this is what we do instead of productive things. We go, hey, hey, look. I'm wearing crusty shorts. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? Hello, Marnie. Where are you? Oh, I think she's out back uh, balancing the checkbook, and that is not a euphemism. Well, hot damn, she's not here either. She heard I was strutting my stuff in my crusty shorts. <laughs> she wanted nothing to do with it. <laughs> Uh, there she is, there she is. Hello, Marnie. My crops are healthy this season. I expect I'll make a good profit. Well, that has nothing to do. Did you notice my... No, nothing? Ah. Uh, Marnie, I was told you would be appalled. That's not as fun. So, we had one no-show and one, uh, complete ambivalence. Oh, what is this? Hi, Sid. Hey. Oh, she looks sad. I just wanted to say I'm sorry for running away from you the other day. I hadn't apologized to you properly for that. Must have been confusing. Uh, I'm kind of used to it, especially now that I wear these sweet, sweet shorts. Why? Oh, I was just really embarrassed. I don't sing around other people. Amen, sister. Like, ever. <laughs> I really liked listening to you sing. There was nothing to be shy about. I'm going to say I really like, because you, you don't tell someone, oh, there's no reason to be. If they feel shy, they feel shy. You just tell them you liked it rather than, you're wrong. We go with positive affirmation here. Oh. <laughs> you really liked it? I, thank you. I, I want you to listen to the song I'm writing when it's done. I don't have many friends my age, and I don't want to ask my family what they think. They're too supportive and might not give me honest feedback. <laughs> uh, but please don't tell anyone about it, okay? Oh, mad face, wait. Gotta get a shot of that. That's going in the thumb. I look so ridiculous in these shorts. Thanks, uh, I'm actually kind of excited, Sid. I'll let you know when it's done. Thank you, ma'am. Appreciate it. I better go back to the farm now. I only came in town to buy seeds from Pierre. Ugh. See you, Sid. Sorry, I threw up in my mouth a little bit. Uh, and I'm sorry again. You and Alyssa bump into each other as you both try to go your own way. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Again, Sid. <laughs> oh, gosh. See ya. Go goodbye. Soon. Again. This is... I. This is the most awkward thing. I, I move so you can go ahead. <laughs> oh, Yoba. Why are we so out of sync? This must be a fairly high heart event with her. I feel like I'm guessing six-ish. Uh, come on, Grover. Can I can I trash dive while I'm on Grover? It appears not. Uh, I am curious though. Let's see where are we at with Alyssa. Um, do do do. Boy, howdy! It's a minute, isn't it? Wow. Okay, so it's not. Unless I just skipped her. No, only four hearts. That is interesting. Okay. Uh, oh, you know what? After we go harass Lewis, I... After we go harass Lewis, I would like to, uh... Well, A, find Lance, but also, um, we need to go gift Sonny. Uh, try to get him up to eight hearts, because I don't know if I brought this up. I think I did. But the... Where is the mayor? Uh, but... He is who holds the uh, recipe for whatever confection it is we need um, to give to the trash panda. So it, we, we, I don't really care. I mean, I like Sonny, but I never really cared about getting his hearts up. Uh, but now we do, you know, we're <laughs> because all interactions with human beings are transactional. Uh, now that he has something to give us, I, I want to talk to him, I guess. <laughs> right? I'm not a sociopath. You're a sociopath. Um, 
where is Lance? Ah, oh, man. Um, okay. Was it a letter we had on us, or was it... It's not in the collection. I looked. Um, but you know what? Since we can, he's either going to be here at the desert or at his place. And since this is a quick skip jump away, um, let's go see if he is home. It doesn't look like it. I think he generally stands outdoors. But I don't know. I don't know his schedule very well. Oh, <laughs> duh. Um, I think this means he's in the desert. Hmm. Well, you know what? Wow, moss grows even out here. That's interesting. Even works in the mod. I mean, I guess, obviously, it, it should. They're using the same assets, but uh, still, cool to know. Cool to know. Um, we're going to go back. And I'm going to find that piece of paper uh, because I really want to know where Lance is. I was carrying it on me, but then once we sort of got the number of days, um, once we sort of got the number of hearts with him we needed, I, I kind of quit uh, focusing on it. And it was just sort of an as we see him thing. But since it's his birthday, I mean, come on. Uh, and yeah, chat is confirming that it is a letter, so uh, I must have put it somewhere. So we'll get back to the house. I'm going to find that, and then I will be right back. Okay, so I cannot find the piece of paper. Um, we definitely had it. Uh, it. I'm wondering if it maybe got lost in one of the in, in the update. Um, if it did, it is what it is. Um, but speaking of hearts, we need to make sure that Honk gets her pet. She's a detective. She needs reassurance, or she'll stumble into alcoholism. Uh, I'm, again, I'm pretty sure that's part of being a detective. Uh, but. Since we couldn't find it, and we've owned it before, I just Googled it. Because, you know, what? why make it harder on ourselves? Uh, and it, it, it is one of the three places that we thought. So, that being said, I don't really feel bad. It says he's at the outpost. Hello, sir. We are the spearhead that'll enforce a safe world. Yes. I concur. Master Kenobi should go. Uh, here you go. Have some cloth. Ah, a gift for yet another rotation around our star. I appreciate this. Verily. Okay, uh, that was a weird interaction, Lance, but I like you, so any interaction's a good one. <laughs> right? And again, the, uh, Warp Hub just, just doing the heavy lifting. It's insane. Okay, um, now, we are off to Ridgeside, and then we're gonna give, uh, did I have any goat cheese on me? Well, pooper doodles, I do not. Um... I was told he really likes goat cheese. Uh, shoo bop. Do we have, we should have some in the, the thing? We do. Okay. Excuse me, everybody. I know it's time, time for beds. We'll just take a single one for now. Uh, and then I'll come back and deal with all this. So, yeah, we're going to go up there. And in fact, I'm going to leave Grover because I'm going to warp back. And I don't want to leave the poor guy stranded. I mean, we are texting him in the, swa sw the, the swamp of sadness or sorrows or whatever. Anyway, sorry about that. Uh, we had a sneeze in the room. But, uh, yeah, we're going back here. Uh, I forget what I was saying. Oh, yeah, we killed, we killed Grover the other day. So I want to make sure that he's... Uh, Looked after, if at all possible. So, Sonny uh, is generally pretty easy to find, given the fact that he has a uh, a distinct job, and that is to look after the uh, ever-miserable, but always rich, Amethines. Now, within the massive confines of this house, uh, that kind of remains to be seen. Oh, right, they have an entire spa. I forgot. Um, 
perhaps, uh, okay, so this is his room. Um, we have a library here, a garden. Is there a kitchen? There's, um, what's her name? There she is. There he is, rather. Um, I was told he loves goat cheese. Let's see. Oh, it seems he likes goat cheese. Really, any cheese. Well, that's good enough. Oh, may Yoba bless your soul. My gratitude for this. You're very welcome, Sonny. How you doing? Some people inquire a lot as to why an influential family such as the Amethines would choose to live in a place like this. Well, it's beautiful. As their butler, I have been in many places, but none of them has felt as right as here in Ridgeside. I do love Ridgeside. We don't spend enough time here, but I do love the place. Um, it was also mentioned that when it comes to getting people's hearts up, that you really can't discount the, um, the magic of the theater. So we may have to use the movie theater a bit, um, but that is another thing. I'm going to have to Google, um who likes what because there's really no way to know that outside of uh guessing you know oh this person doesn't like being scared like like for instance you probably don't want to take demetrius to a scary movie because he he doesn't care he's an analytical guy but if there was like a nature documentary ah oh, that might be something he would be into right um but i honestly i don't know which movie's playing i don't know any of that so I think that's worth maybe popping over and checking that out tomorrow um, because I love the theater and let's go check it out. But we can use that to our advantage and, uh, I don't know, get a little bit of, um, whoa, whoa, whoa. Get a few heart upgrades uh, while also getting to see a movie. Birds and stones, birds and stones, right? Okay, I'm going to finish doing a few things around here and then we'll get on with the night, which probably means going to bed. But, uh, yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, well, all of that out of the way, um, fairly productive day. We ended up having quite a lot go on there at the old pickling palace. Uh, so we're going to start doing some more pickled carrots, which I'm excited about. Uh, so, oh, I didn't age that. Um, actually, we don't really have any space, so we're just, we're selling. You know what? It's okay. Um, that is okay. Uh, but yeah, we got a lot of cranberry jelly, which, uh, I know you're supposed to use fruit to make, um to make wine, but, you know, here we are. It, it is what it is. Uh, also, I think I am going to move real quick. Um, well, maybe not move. I just, I need to actively start using the, uh, whoops, that's a bone. I need to start using the recycling machines a bit more. So maybe having something in it will, uh, help me. Scoot over, Jeff. Okay, well, this is my first recording in uh, quite a few days, like I said. So, uh, it's pretty all over the place. But, um, I think we got a lot done. So, hopefully, we, that can be a trend. The getting a lot done, not the all over the place. But it's me, so who knows. Uh, but either way, I appreciate you hanging out. Um, yeah, be good to each other. I will talk to you tomorrow, and good night.